गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अड्डा ट्वेंटी फोर सेवन वी आर इन सिलेक्शन एम सी क्यू सीरीज फॉर रिटेल बैंकिंग एंड वेल्थ मैनेजमेंट एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज ऑब्जेक्टिव क्वेश्चन ऑन जनरल बैंकिंग जनरल मीन्स कॉमन रिटेल बैंकिंग विच वी फेस इन आर डेली लाइफ रिमेंबर वी स्टडी ऑल द डिफिकल्ट पार्ट एंड वी गेट क्लीन बोल्ड ऑन द बेसिक प्रॉब्लम इन बैंकिंग सो इन एग्जाम बेसिक्स आर आस्ट एज वेल एज द डिफिकल्ट वन आर आस्ट so follow this video completely let's start which of the following defines retail banking the banking service that is geared primarily towards individuals the banking that deals with lending money to individual consumers rather than corporates that part of the banking that is meant for small account holders only one only one and two one two and three all and only two and three so what is the correct answer is a, is the banking service I mean general banking service we are talking here mainly of retail banking is this retail banking or general banking geared up for primarily towards individuals or is it lending to individual consumers or to small account holders or is it to all of them or is it nothing the option might not be there but is it nothing yeah The answer is what everyone. See, our general banking we are talking of the daily banking which we do. In our branch, we always see those retail customers, individuals coming to you. You give the loans to the individuals, housing loan, com- this consumer loan, car loan, two two wheeler loan, gold loan. All these loans are given to individual custom consumers. Then. third is third part is small account holder small account holder means here retail banking does not only include consumers retail banking also includes small accounts means what it can be proprietorship current accounts also proprietorship partnership even lending to the smaller institutions in form of cc cash credit okay private limited companies those are also uh, many a times uh, this uh, brought under the small account concepts okay because we give loans to them also we give loans to llps we will give loans to private limited companies to proprietorships to partnerships we give loans to all of these as far as their turnovers are lesser in that case only they are considered under retail banking so small account holders is again the right answer individual cons- consumers again the right answer and primarily geared gear towards individual again the right answer answer is c got it the advantages of retail banking include so what are the advantages high interest spreads risk spread over large client base strong customer loyalty high volatility in demand for retail products so what is the correct answer let's see a to d all let me make this a to d all means higher interest spreads spread over large client base and consumer loyalty customer loyalty and high volatility means now this is a twist okay a to d all a to c only a and b and b and c so there is a twist over here okay some of you might be thinking about a but a is not the answer take it from me A is not the answer. So what is the answer then? If A is not the answer, then what is the answer? Is it A to C, A and B? Okay. What is the, uh, this uh, higher interest spreads? Higher interest spreads means here. If I am giving a loan to Reliance, let me br- bring two scenarios over here. Okay. If I am giving a loan to Reliance, okay, what will Reliance have? Reliance will have their own team. learned team i will call it learned team okay they will know what is the repo rate what is the reverse repo rate they'll know everything but if i'm giving the loan to re- uh, retail individual customer will that customer know what is the present uh, scene in uh, scenario in this uh, re- repo rate or reverse repo rate or what the rbi is doing about mss or msf facility will the retail customer know all these things no so what happens when the customer doesn't know anything you can charge a bit higher spreads what what will happen is for reliance if i go and tell him that yes 
I'll give you a loan at around eight percent. Okay, the learned team of Reliance will say, presently the repo rate is let's say at six point five. I won't give you any rate other than six point five plus point two five. Earn only point two five. So Reliance team will know what is the repo rate going on, what is the reverse repo rate going on. Okay, but will your retail customer tell you that okay, presently if I tell him that um, the rate of interest is nine percent. Will that customer uh, tell me that okay, the rate of interest is right now repo is at six point five, so you don't charge me plus this uh, extra two point five for me? Never. What happens? Retail customer generally doesn't know about this nitty gritties of RBIs and the uh, the details of the financial markets. So in that case, what happens? You can charge a bit higher. You can earn a bit higher. So that's why. Higher interest spreads can be a feature of retail banking. Okay, number two, risk spread over large client base. This is also true. Giving one loan to Reliance of let's say one crore. Okay, and in retail banking, this one crore will be divided into what? This one crore will be divided into around let's say one thousand clients. So if I divide this one crore into one thousand plans, each one will get around one lakh rupees, right? So one lakh loan is distributed to one thousand plans over here. So because of this, what happens? My risk gets lower, lesser. Means what? One company can go down any time. Just now we saw in that SVB Bank. Or oh, everyone has heard about this, right? Fast SVB Bank. From where was this SVB Bank? India or USA type fast SVB bank. Where was this SVB bank? Recently it was in news, right? Yesterday, day before yesterday, even today it's in you in uh, in news. Okay, so SVB bank. This bank was in which country? India or USA? It is in USA. Correct. What? Uh, okay, another one. Credit Suisse. From where is this company? Which the, is this bank? Credit Suisse. It was in news recently, right? Everyone has heard about this bank. What is happening about it? There is a there was a huge collapse going on for SVB Bank, but it was bailed out. Credit Suisse that also it was facing a huge crunch, but it was bailed out in some other source. Then which is the third bank which was uh, under the trouble now? Anyone? 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 Which was the third bank recently in USA? All the banks are from USA. There is a huge trouble going on. This this is called a systemic risk going on. Systemic risk going on means one bank is in trouble. All the banks come in trouble. So this was a systemic risk. And which is the third bank then? The third bank was anyone? Think fast. Which is the third bank which was in trouble? It is called as First Republic Bank, right? It was First Republic Bank. First Republic. This was the name. This was the third bank. They had put in some thirty billion or something, some amount in that bank, and then bailed out. So that's why uh, this corporate banking <coughs> will always have a trouble. One client goes down, everything goes down. So that's why in retail banking it's better. The higher the risk is spread over large client base. So it it can never happen that all the one thousand clients become NPS. One client can become NPA of one crores very easy, but one thousand clients of one lakh becoming NPA very difficult. Customer loyalty, strong customer loyalty. That is the answer. That is of course. How many times? Just tell me in the comment section. How many times have you seen the customer shifting the bank? Retail customer. Today I am having an account in SBI. Tomorrow I am having in my account in PNB. Then in HDFC Bank. Then in ICICI Bank. Then some other bank. How many times does the customer do uh, do this? Never. Okay, it's very rare. So strong customer loyalty is also the answer. So the uh, correct answer is what? It is B A to C, right? Volatility in demand of retail product that is not the right answer, because in retail product there is no never a huge volatility. Plus or minus five ten percent year and there it's okay. Is the uh, this year my home loans are one thousand crores? Next year they will be around one thousand one hundred crores, or nine nine hundred crores. Okay, but it won't from one thousand it won't go to two thousand, or it won't come down to four hundred.
okay so the advantage correct answer is what only a to c which of the following is a characteristics of retail banking characteristics important point about retail the banking services provided ta target the individual customers is it so yes these activities are focused on mass market segment is it so yes the large corporates having large number of employees are also provided banking facilities under the credit uh, credit re retail banking means large number of employees are there so is it so yes no this is not yes this is not yes retail banking is ge geared towards individual customers okay mass market segment okay but large corporates means this comes under corporate banking or wholesale banking so this can't be true although it is given here for uh, means uh, this uh, a sort of fooling you the options given over here are having large number of employees so when we see large number of employees over here we immediately feel that yes it might be a part of retail banking but it's not because the first word is important over here retail banking will not cater to large corporates tata is having large number of uh, employees reliance is having large number of employees adani is having all large number of employees right adani was in the recent news right so that's why again come up but adani has grown very fast okay and it was it was definite to grow okay coming back chalo so large corporates immediately we see the name that is not a part of retail banking so what is the characteristic 1 to 3 all 1 and 2 only 2 and 3 only 1 and 3 only so what is the correct answer over here the correct answer is 1 and 2 only right there is no third answer over here got it clear everyone retail banking services can be extended through which of the following means retail banking how can the customer access the retail banking service means what how can i access my saving account how can i access my current account how can i access my cc account how can i access my loan account how can i get a new loan remember saving current accessing is different nowadays things have gone ahead getting a new loan is also accessible through internet and mobile banking now so retail banking services can be extended through branches and internet banking only branches and atms only atms and internet banking only branches atms internet banking and mobile banking all of them so what is the answer over here a b c or d is it through all can i access my loan through branches can i access my loan through atms yes up till now some atms are not giving many of the atms are acting as a cash dispensing machine cash dispensing means what Ca cdm we call it cdm cash dispensing machine only cash giving machine but now atms are changing we are calling them as there is other word to atms now that is called as kiosks what is kiosk kiosk means i will what will i do i'll do major transactions in atm i'll get the loan i'll get access my account i'll uh, if i want to do nowadays i'll tell you in kiosk the things are happening like i can book my train bookings through kiosks that is also possible through atm now so things have changed a lot ATM is no more that cash giving machine now. Okay, internet banking. That's obvious. In internet banking, I can access all my services. I can apply for the loans. I can apply for the checkbook. Right. I can stop the checks. Mobile banking. Same. Everything is available in mobile banking now. Nowadays, mobile banking banking has shifted to what app banking. Earlier, mobile banking was only limited to what SMS. Get the statements. Get the balance. and then something like that related means what are your transactions this much only so now it has shifted from that sms banking to app banking okay so the correct answer is what d i can access my retail banking services through branches atms internet banking mobile banking and variety of other features okay now before going i had download adda 247 app on your mobile in this app you will be getting the premium study material current affairs job alerts daily quizzes here 
new job openings also importantly why am i telling you this because nowadays we are in finance world we can shift the jobs from here and there okay so definitely you can go for it also you will be getting live classes ebooks tests for gib and cib so follow it come immediately download the app immediately also subscribe to officers at the 247 youtube channel in this channel you will be getting the latest updates on gib and cib and importantly you will be getting the free youtube series on all the subjects of gib and cib right now you what are you watching you are watching the free youtube series okay so download it now subscribe to it now click on the bell icon everyone do it fast okay everyone like the video first everyone like this video kind because what happens if you like the video the buffering is correct also share it with your friends because it's a free knowledge why not to share what are what are available uh, in free you can share it in your groups isn't it which of the following is not a feature of retail banking not now we want not a feature okay they are provided through branches as well as through virtual banking channels they can be extended only for amounts which are very small in size they can be offered both for liability and other asset products they can be extended to small business also small size business also so is this which of them is not we want to find out the false one now not the true one so in true one they can be access provided through branches as well as virtual banking channels just now we saw it so that is true but i want what false what is my requirement my requirement is false but this is true so this is not my answer next one these can be extended only for amounts which are very small in size now is this the answer yes this is false retail banking is not only related to only small in size amounts only small in size amounts means see here retail banking will have one feature of small size accounts also jandhan accounts are there ods of rupees 5000 are there i can give a consumer loan of let's say 5000 10000 roughly but that is not a limitation i can give of this but i can also give a loan of 1 crore or 2 crore in retail banking right nowadays this housing segment has grown so lot uh, so huge in a major cities you are getting houses at around 2 crores so if the housing is at 2 crores my loan will be what around 75% of that right if i give a loan of 75% of 2 crores then also it comes to 1.5 crores so that's why my retail banking is not only limited to small size it can be for a higher size also so these products can be offered for liability as well as asset products obviously retail liability means deposit asset means your loan products so that is also true but i want false so this is true so this answer is not required by me these can be extended to small size businesses also yeah that is also true means proprietorship partnership mainly but i want false so this is not the answer so only answer is b now okay they can be extended only for amounts very small in size i want not the feature okay which of the following is uh, not an advantage in retail banking sir it was the questions are only on basic banking i don't say all of the questions will come to you in exam from this session but one of them may be there because these are all similar types of questions but you'll get one of them and you what happens if we don't know we get clean bold on such basic questions which of the following is not an advantage not okay again the same logic credit risk well diversified so is this true well diversified means 1 one, 1 one crore given to 1000 customers so this is known as credit risk well diversified means what it won't happen that all the customers will become np at the same time so this is true so i want not the feature again look at the question i want false answer but this is true so this is not the right answer so this is true i'll write it okay regular demand for products from customers so this is also true because regular demand for products the uh, the demand for products of retail banking never changes in a huge size in a uh, huge magnitude this time my home loans are let's say 1000 crores next year they are 2000 crores it never happens like this 
from 1000 crores the home loans will grow to 1100 crores 10% year and year 15% year and year 20% not more than 20% so this is also true but i don't want true now cnd you will have to search because otherwise if i give all the answers what will you do mass selling of products the average cost of returning the customer is very high so we want not the advantage so what is the true answer over here mass selling and average cost of returning the customer is very high so the false one is this the average cost of returning uh, returning the customer is very low over here in retail banking customers are very simple in retail banking they if they shift the bank they can immediately come back depending on the service which you give the service the sweetness of your discussion with the clients you have to be courteous to the clients courteous means you have to be empathetic to those clients if you do that retail banking clients will come back to you so the correct answer is this it's not high it's very less and mass selling of products that is true because we are in the mass market only but that is true means i don't want this answer so the answer is d okay now let me talk to you about this batch this batch recently started about jib all the four subjects are covered ppb ifs afm and retail banking and wealth management numericals objective questions case studies everything is covered 80% discount you are getting it presently under the scheme use the code y432 if you are having the maha pack if you go for the maha pack you are getting double validity what is the maha pack 15 plus batches per subject ppb 15 ifs 15 afm 15 and retail 15 okay so go for this immediately it's an investment for lifetime everyone like this video right now share comment in the uh, give the comments in the comment section click on the bell icon everyone okay let me go to the other question the retail banking suffers from which of the following disadvantage directly move to disadvantage okay constant remove this so the retail banking suffers from which of the following disadvantages which of them is not correct see here the questions are difficult this time over here okay we all want not correct means again false we want the false ones why i have taken all, all these tricky questions over here because in exams you will be getting such tricky questions which of them is not correct which of them is false which of them is not the feature such questions we get it and we need to think in the reverse direction in such cases the problem of managing large number of individual customers it's not of uh, no follow it means suffers from disadvantage so not correct so many large number of customers that's true because there are a large number of customers so this is true part but i don't want true quick evaluation of products that led to it complications means products you may fastly move out move out and they become fastly or go in the declining stage of the life cycle so that is also true or false what do you say let's see okay availability of higher spreads so higher spreads means the spread is higher Spre what do you mean the spread is higher net interest margin is higher so this is a disadvantage or this is an advantage right so what do i want which of them is not the disadvantage so you are not correct so i want not the disadvantage okay so i want the advantage so the correct answer is what this is fall this is not a disadvantage this is an advantage the availability of higher spreads is the advantage so i'll write it over here advantage we want what what is the requirement that's what i am saying it's a tricky question i want whichever them which of them is not the disadvantage means which of them is the advantage so my answer will be c over here remember this not not two negatives make one positive right disadvantage is a negative word not is a negative word so not disadvantage means it becomes an advantage so the answer is c over here okay because this is an advantage okay level of irregularity in the loans is very high this is not the uh, this correct answer again okay so the answer is c to cover the higher operational cost in offering retail banking banks encourage use of atm telephone banking internet banking call centers and branch banking a b c d e which of them is correct to cover the higher operational cost 
सो बैंक विल टेल द कस्टमर टू यूज ए टी एम मशीन टेलीफोन मशीन इंटरनेट मशीन कॉल सेंटर मशीन दैट इज ऑल्सो आफ्टर ऑल मशीन ओनली ओके इट्स अ ऑर्गेनाइज कॉल सेंटर सो द कॉस्ट इज वेरी लेस ओवर यूर ब्रांच बैंकिंग दिस इज अज कॉस्ट सो टू कवर द ऑपरेशनल कॉस्ट दिस बैंक विल नेवर टेल द कस्टमर टू गो टू द ब्रांच बैंकिंग बिकॉज दैट विल एडअप टू द कॉस्ट सो ई मे ई विल नॉट बी द आंसर द करेक्ट आंसर विल बी वॉट ए टू डी ए टू सी ए एंड बी बी सी एंड डी सो वट इज द करेक्ट आंसर ओवर यूर इट इज ए टू डी ऑल ओके सो दैट इज द आंसर ओके नाउ आई शो यू हाउ टू गेट दिस डिस्काउंट यूज द कोड वाई फोर थ्री टू बट हाउ टू यूज let me go to at that 247 live if you are having the app go on go through the app in the app you'll be getting 1% extra okay let's go to at that 247 live see this on at that 247 live once you go there you will get for first page only click on jib and cib see the jib and cib you see jib cib mahabex jib 23 jib 23 click on jib 23 you'll get the batches click on this english batch you'll see the details what are the dates what are the timings what are the day uh, durations of the class study plans everything recorded videos are available read through it importantly recorded videos means what you can get the get the de- get the videos again if you miss out on any class due to some banking pressure two interactive classes are there two interactive means you can ask the questions there and then itself okay ebooks are available tests are available what do what do you require more let's look at the fees part 19999 click on view offers put the code y432 y432 click on apply you'll see this 19999 reduces to 3999 such a huge discount you are getting validity is 6 months okay in fact i would suggest go for the mahapax in mahapax once you go remember in mahapax you get 15 plus batches per subject okay what is mahapax all the subjects will be getting the map, uh, the 15 plus batches means what all subjects are we talking of let me show you jib ka mahapack click on jib mahapack so this will be getting 15 plus batches for ppb ifs afm and retail banking and wealth management all the four subjects ebooks are available tests are available then you are getting uh, this module wise uh, question banks you are getting module wise tests also you are getting the uh module wise this uh, uh test i have already told you so let's look at the view offers click on view offers put the code y432 y432 click on apply now 32796 reduces to 6559 and look at the validity validity is 12 months such a huge offer go for it right now because this is an investment for lifetime i'll be back tomorrow with another session till then keep studying Also, I would suggest the offer is going on. It won't last long, so join the offer, join the batches immediately. It's an investment for your life.